A state of emergency has been issued for 54 of the 67 Florida counties ahead of Tropical Storm and potential Hurricane Debbie. Here's a full list of all the counties affected by the state of emergency. And here's the area of concern in Vest 97L, which has a 60% chance of development over the next 48 hours, as well as a 90% chance of development over the next seven days. And you'll notice that this did not get pulled out into the Atlantic like some of the models predicted a few days ago. Instead, it's moving west towards the Gulf of Mexico. And early spaghetti models do have this storm making landfall somewhere along Florida's Gulf Coast as a tropical storm or a low end hurricane. And while it's not trending, a few of the models do have it hovering somewhere up here here near Florida's Big Bend region, and it's important to note that if that does happen, it will continue to strengthen as this area has some of the warmest water in the Gulf of Mexico. And regardless of how strong this storm does become, we're going to see lots of rainfall and potential flooding from this system. Most of these affected counties already have free sandbag sites set up, and it might not be a bad idea if you live in a low-lying area to put sandbags around points of entry in your home where water could potentially get inside.